Hey guys, how are you doing? My name is Cheese and welcome to my channel. Today I'll be starting another new series. Um, I know I said before that I would only do three seasonals, but from this series I heard a lot of good things about it. I also read a lot of good things about it. And I also read it like a little bit curious from the beginning, but now like since a couple of weeks have passed, I got more and more curious, so that's why I thought I should definitely react to this one because this is supposed to be really good. So yeah, I'm going to react to Kaze ga tsuyoku fuiteiru. The, the English title is Run With The Wind, which is another sports anime. I know I'm already reacting to another sports anime, Hinomaru Zumo, but um, yeah, this is also supposed to be really good and I'm already like... Uh, a big fan of sports anime in general so yeah that's why I just couldn't resist reacting to this one so today I'm gonna react to the first episode I know I'm already like a couple of weeks late because they already like aired three episodes or so so I'm gonna try to watch all these three episodes which have come out the uh, last few weeks today if that doesn't work I'm gonna try to watch them this week so I can watch like the next uh, upcoming episode together with you guys I don't know when the next episode is gonna come out uh, if it comes out like today or tomorrow then probably I'll catch up with you guys like next week I suppose uh, because I'm also like quite busy this week so I don't know when I can watch all the three episodes or three or four but today I'm gonna react to the first episode at least and um, yeah I'm really curious uh, as I said before I heard a lot of good things about it I heard it's also made by the people who made Haikyuu and Haikyuu is like one of my all-time favorite sports anime so I'm especially excited about that. Also the soundtracks are made by the person who also did the soundtracks of My Hero Academia. So there's some good stuff behind it. So I don't know why I didn't react to it sooner. But yeah, so I'm gonna start on it now, like I said a couple of times already. But now I'm gonna really start with the episode. So I'm just gonna stop talking and get right into the episode. <laughs> Alright, everything is ready. So I'm gonna start the episode in 3, 2, 1. Go. Oh yeah, there's already someone running. Up. Oh. Like running? <laughs> All right. Okay, so we get straight into the opening. Oh yeah, if I'm correct, uh, the opening is sung by, um... Oh damn, I forgot the name. Okay, I suppose that's the main character. Ooh, a redhead. Oh, I feel so stupid for not remembering the name of this band. They're so famous and they make a lot of good songs.
I still couldn't come up with the name. I'm sorry. Ah. Uh... Mira. <laughs> Jota. King. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> Self proclaimed king of trivia. Oh, that's a lot of manga. <laughs> oh, he's pretty. <laughs> Prince. <laughs> okay. Oh, so does everyone have like a nickname? Mikucha Senpai. <laughs> oh, oh, Nico from Nicotine. I get it. I'm glad that they get like nicknames because like the normal names are all so long so I'm glad we get like nicknames so it's easy to remember them. That's the landlord. Oh. Oh, okay. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, what? <laughs> the dance man. Coach. Okay. <laughs> Hi, G. <laughs> <Woo -hoo. laughs> He's like what? He has no idea what's what's happening to him. <laughs> That's right, they're all college students. 
<laughs> recommending a book and then just say like, oh yeah, you just buy it yourself. So, oh, so that guy's Haiji. <laughs> he really looks like. That main character really li reminds me of Kageyama from Haikyuu. <laughs> <laughs> He's getting a headache already. <laughs> He's like, uh, what's happening? <laughs> <laughs> but that's basically uh, they're always like that like when college students go on a trip they do exactly like the same things as they would do at home but they're like somewhere else <laughs> <laughs> oh damn, look at that scar. I look at that body though. <laughs> not complaining, not complaining.
Oh, that was at the beginning of the episode. Oh, so this is how they met. Oh, okay. Ooh. Whoa, that animation. Oh, poor guy. Oh, okay, and that's how, how you went after him. Did he really steal something? Oh! Whoa! Look at that animation though! Yes! Oh, it really gives, gives me like those high Q vibes. Now also in high Q they really focus on the eyes and they, I see that they do that in this anime as well. <laughs> yeah, keep on moving. <laughs> oh yeah, it's the first time you hear his name. The other guys just kept calling him newbie. <laughs> oh damn. Aww, the is a good guy. So yeah, this is actually what happened before he met all the other guys. Even the key is old. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and then he met everyone. They had a party. Ooh, you hear with the like the wind in the background? Oh, he's not really thrilled about that. <laughs> no one knew about it. <laughs> no one knew about it. Oh, damn. <laughs> no one knew about it. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that is really cheap. <laughs> oh 
So the landlord is the coach. Yeah, okay, so he has some history in athletics. already. <laughs> Oh, nice music. I love Star Trek. He's running again. Oh. Awkward. Okay, so he's still recovering from that injury. <laughs> Ooh. He already knew about you. Oh, beautiful. Was this already the end of the first episode? Oh yeah, I remember, yeah, the group of the opening is Union, uh, Union Square Garden. I, I just remember, but yeah, <laughs> I couldn't come up with the name at the opening, but now I remember. But this ending so also sounds good. Okay, I'm gonna listen to the ending first and then I'm gonna um, say my, uh, do my review of this episode. Oh, yes! So yeah, that was the first episode, and it was, it was so good. It was such a good episode. Um, I don't know, it's not like so many things are happening, but just with the music, the voice acting, and I think the story was like, it's already great, like in the first episode. 
I have like such high hopes now. I'm, I'm definitely gonna watch the next episode as well right after this. Um, but yeah, so in this episode we got introduced to all the door members, to the main characters Kakeru and uh, Haiji. <laughs> Haiji plays also a big role in this series, I think. Yeah, Haiji got finally his 10th member and with the 10 members of the dorm who were uh, like uh, who suddenly got to know that they are like members of the track and field club of the university um, yeah they suddenly um, gonna participate in the what's it called Hakoden Hakoden I'm not 100 percent sure and everyone was so surprised, like they, no, no one knew about it. <laughs> oh, but like the characters are already amazing. I think some of them, and they are like, uh, they have kind of like unique characters. It's not like they are super like stereotypic, but just they have still have their own personality, which are which is still very strong, I believe. Like the, it, it's just like, oh, he's the nerd. He's like the computer freak. He's like I don't know the the I don't know the pretty guy like usually in anime you have those stereotypes but in this anime like no one is has really that strong stereotypic characteristics but still has like strong personality which makes you um, able to distinguish him much easier from other characters as well as like I said earlier giving them nicknames really also makes you remember their names much more easily so yeah, usually I'm really bad at remembering names, but now I already like know some of their names, like Haiji, Kakeru, well those are not really like the nicknames. Well you have Prince, um, King, <laughs> yes the Prince and King, um, who else, uh, the Joe brothers, <laughs> Joe G and Joe, <laughs> I forgot the other one, also Joe something. And Niko-chan, the, the, uh, the old looking guy, he also reminds me of um, Asahi from Haikyuu. So you can see like there are also like a lot of similarities between Haikyuu and this series. Like the main character Kakeru, he reminds me so much of Kageyama. <laughs> so, and also like the, of course, the the character designs really remind me of Ka Haikyuu. So there are a lot of similarities, but I think it's so good. Um, also the animation in this episode was solid. Like even those simple running scenes, um, uh, Aside from the like the scene where it's like animated like with all the special effects, you know, where where Kakeru uh, ran past uh, Haiji. Aside from that, even like the normal running scenes are animated so well. Like it's difficult to animate nor like running scenes. Like there are not that many anime series that can uh, like make good running animation. Sometimes it feels like a little bit distorted or like. I don't know, it doesn't feel really right, but it just feel, seems so natural in this series and I think they did a good job with that. So story-wise was also great. Like not a lot of things happened because this episode was mainly about introducing the characters and um, I think like introducing the main goal of this series which is running the Hakoden A... Hakoen Ikiden? Ka something like that. Um, but yeah, uh, Kakeru, who seems like the most experienced runner out of everyone, was like the least thrilled about it. He was like, no way, no way. Um, so yeah, it, maybe it has something to do with like a backstory. I don't know, but I'm really curious to find out more about him. And I'm so excited to watch the next episode already, so... I'm gonna stop talking about this episode. This episode was fantastic and I'm just gonna hop right into the next one. <laughs> so I hope to see you also again uh, at my reaction video of the next episode. So if you like my reaction for this episode, please give this video a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, please feel free to subscribe to my channel. So thank you all for watching and I hope to see you all next time. Bye bye!